The Amazon rainforest is the largest on Earth. It's so immense that it influences the water cycle of the planet. But that's not the only reason that it's so valuable to us. Equatorial rainforests are our planet's greatest natural wonders, and the Amazon is the biggest of them all. Its eight million square kilometers cover nine countries. It looks as though it should be teeming with animals, but under its vast canopy lies a world dominated by plants. Although it looks lush, the rainforest puts extreme demands on animals. Countless different species live here, but only a small number of each, and they've had to become highly specialized. The arowana, with perhaps the best eyesight of any fish in the world. This is the only place on the planet where a fish can leap up to two meters out of the water to hunt its prey. Dark, threatening, and inauspicious. This must have been what Europeans used to think of Amazonia. Scientists entered Amazonia reluctantly, believing it to be a journey into the heart of darkness. Venomous creatures, diseases and parasites, deadly threats to anyone who dared enter such unknown terrain. In the mid-19th century, an English scientist braved these dangers and penetrated deep into the Amazon jungle. He spent four years along the Rio Negro, guided by local people. He was driven by an obsession to describe as many different species as possible. His name was Alfred Russell Wallace. His passion for collecting specimens began with British insects. In the Amazon, he was overwhelmed by the variety he found. The competition between plants and animals is constant. One of the most successful attacks on rainforest giants is staged by one of the smallest animals. This ant's mandibles are like a circular saw. And it's one of millions, defoliating a huge tree bit by bit. Even today, the Matis are deeply in tune with the symphony of species around them. Over thousands of years, they've learned how best to survive in this most complicated of worlds. Their facial decorations resemble the jaguar, the mightiest hunter in the rainforest. Thank you. 